Hola, bienvenidos. Here we are, number 11 of our verb building uh, series. And uh, we're still in the S's, okay? And then we move to the T's. So, the first verb, are you ready? Now, the first one is to feel. And this is to feel emotions, to feel emotions, okay? And the verb is sentirse, sentirse, okay? So, when you feel emotions, can you hear the word tear in there, tear, okay? And when you feel emotions, sometimes you can sense a tear here, yeah? You can sense a tear, sentirse. Okay? So that's how you remember it. You just sense a tear because of the emotion. Okay. To feel. Next one. Now this one is a super important verb. Okay. We've done estar. Can you remember estar? I want to be estar. Okay. To be. Well, there's another verb to be. And that one is ser. Ser. Now, again, I'm not going to go into the reasons why there are two verbs. You'll find that in the book. It explains it perfectly. And in all of our videos on Lightspeed Spanish, if you search for ser and estar, you'll find lots of information. But what I would like you to be aware of is that the verb ser is the verb to be. I am, you are, he is, she is, we are. Okay, it's a very important verb. How are you going to remember this one is... In England, if you've done something really well, you can be knighted, okay? And that's when the Queen hits you on the head with a sword or something, and you, as you stand up, you become a Sir. Sir, whatever, yeah? So you're knighted. So you can imagine saying to somebody, I'm going to be a Sir. Okay, Sir, to be. If you want some help on uh, conjugating that verb, go into Lightspeed Spanish um, and look for the ser song, okay? Or go into YouTube and look for the ser song and you'll see a little tune that we've done uh, that helps you to remember the, uh, the conjugation. Okay, so ser to be. I'm going to be a ser. Okay, next one is the verb to mean. Like to mean something. What does that mean? Okay, and the verb is significar, significar, okay? So we've got a word, significance, haven't we? To signify, and that's from the same root. So to mean in Spanish is to signify, significar. And the question goes like this, ¿Qué significa eso? What does that mean? ¿Qué significa eso? So, that's all you have to remember is that meaning is significance, significar, okay? Next one, into the T's, and this is the verb to have, to have, like I have, to have got, okay? And that verb is tener, tener. So nice and easy, I've got a tenner. In England we call 10 pounds a tenner, okay? So I've got a tenner. Look, way, I'm rich. Tener to have. I have a tenner. Okay. Next one is tomar. Tomar. Now this is the verb to take. Okay. Tomar. Also understand that in uh, many Spanish speaking countries, the verb tomar is also used in, in our sense of to have, to have something to drink or to have something to eat. Okay, tomar. But in its true sense, it's to take. All right, so imagine that I'm going to take a tomahawk with me to my next Spanish class. And if people get it wrong, I'm gonna chop them up. Okay, never happen. So, I'm gonna take a tomahawk, tomar, to take. Okay, and then the last one is to work, okay, to work. And you've already seen this in the other vocabulary builder as a noun. Now I'm going to give you the verb. The verb is trabajar, trabajar, okay. So 
trabajar is like tobacco. Okay, it's the same word as before. Tobacco. And it's strictly prohibited to smoke tobacco when you go a trabajar. No tobacco a trabajar. Okay. <laughs> and then, you know, I always think that on the end of trabajar is har. I want to work hard. Trabajar. Okay. Okay, so there you are. That's our verbs for this particular session. Now I'm going to check you out. Vamos a hacer un repaso. Okay. First verb. Sentirse. Sentirse. Sounds like tear. Sensing a tear. And that's to feel, to feel emotion. Okay, this one, ser, ser. Ser is to be, I'm going to be a ser, okay? And this one, significar, significar. Significance, signify, to mean, significar, to mean. Tener, tener, that's to have, yeah, I have a tenor, okay. Could be a singer as well, couldn't it? I have a tenor voice, <laughs> maybe not. Um, next one, tomar, tomar, okay. Ooh. Chopping up my students, I I'm going to take a tomahawk to my next class. Take. Tomar is to take. And then last one. Trabajar. Trabajar. Okay. It's prohibited to smoke tobacco in work. So trabajar to work. And it's also work hard. Trabajar. Mm -hmm. So trabajar to work. Excellent. How did you do? Did you get them all? These are really short. But that's great because you can just keep them in your mind and then you've got them. Okay? Here, I'll tell you again, you've got them. <laughs> that's a hypnotic command, by the way. Okay, so nos vemos en el siguiente video. Hasta luego. Y es el último, it's the last one, number 12, on the verb section. Hasta luego. <laughs>